Sometimes, the correct response to a question is clear and discreet. Here, the answer is both correct and complete. Often, however, the appropriate response is uncertain or vague. Measurements are uncertain. For example, the speedometers of two cars traveling at the same speed may show two different speeds. This difference between sources is intersource uncertainty. People are often uncertain too. When they give ratings or answer questionnaires, intrasource uncertainty underlies each individual response. They're unsure and could go either way, so some information is lost. Capturing and communicating uncertain information can be tricky, but it underpins many domains. Lucid works on data-driven decision support, which captures, processes, and communicates uncertainty, vagueness, and range to decision makers. To help capture uncertainty, we've created interval-valued questionnaires, which find a quantitative sweet spot between quantitative and qualitative data collection methods. For some judgments, someone's ideal response may be better represented by an interval rather than a discrete point. Responses may need distilling down, but using discrete scales, they are compressed to a single point, which can incur information loss and error. For example, what is a fair price for lunch? Someone might say, three pound, no more, no less. It's narrow, so a discrete scale or interval can capture this. Someone else might say, it varies depending on food quality, options available, location. It could be anywhere between one pound and 10 pound. This can't be captured with a discrete scale, but it can with an interval. So how do we capture richer information? Lucid has created easy-to-use ways to capture a rich, quantitative view of responses using interval responses in the form of ellipses. These can represent response range, vagueness, and uncertainty. This approach is quick and intuitive. We've developed open-source software allowing anyone to build a survey and capture interval-valued and other responses. To demonstrate the interval agreement approach, 40 participants were presented with images of eight marbles and asked to estimate how many blue marbles are in each image. Participant response intervals are plotted in distribution graphs. They drew narrow ellipses, reflecting certainty that there are four blue marbles. Participants are shown a different set of marbles and provide their response. Their response intervals widen as uncertainty increases. A series of experiments showed that participants used the interval-valued scales as expected. Results show that this type of questionnaire is easier to answer and effectively captures valuable information on response uncertainty and range. If intrasource uncertainty or range isn't captured, information is lost. It cannot be recovered statistically or otherwise. 